With Brent and Afni committing to change, my team moved forward, getting rid of all the dust and cobwebs. We furnished all the rooms with brand new bedding, but the biggest change was overhauling the ice cream parlor. Off we go. Ladies, welcome. <gasps> my God! Holy moly! Wow, unbelievable. Unbelievable. This is what I call a parlor. You had a dreadful space yeah. here. Previously. Yes, oh my God. Now, it's turned into something magical. Do you think there's any chance that I could get a sample? <laughs> we will be throwing samples out everywhere. This is way beyond our expectation. Given the importance of the local wineries, I brought in Samilia Dave Foss. How are you? Who repaired the bad reputations with the locals that Brent and Afni had. You're gonna need to nurture those relationships. Right. And he created a brand new menu featuring all Washington wine. You're no longer gonna have to say, sorry, I don't have any local wines. Finally, to accompany all this, I created a smaller, more exciting menu that features all fresh food. Dig in, have a little taste. Oh my God, this is so good. It's delicious. Oh my God. Mm. Everything fresh, better. Mm. Fantastic. What I have learned from this community is that local support is everything, and this town is willing to give Brent and Afni a second chance. Hi, everybody. How are you today? Good to see you guys. Would you like to see my new ice cream parlor here? With all the new improvements, I'm hoping Brent and Afni make a good impression for the people of Chelan. I actually brought you a list of a lot of the purveyors that we work with. Cool. Oh, you want to check in? How are you guys? The hotel is booked up. This is just gorgeous. And the guests will sleep well tonight in the brand new bedding we've added to all the rooms. All right. I'm gonna try the feral salad. There's a real buzz about the new menu. Order up. And the kitchen is easily executing the dishes. A quiche, a chicken sandwich, and I got the salmon. Okay. What we're trying to do is just focus on the local wineries. With the help of Samilia Dave Foss, the customers are pleased with the local selection of wines they're offering at BC McDonald's. You like that? It's really good. Yeah. <laughs> I'm always making a mess. That's the idea. I'm the official scooper. The ice cream shop is a hit, and Brent is even happy giving away samples. If you drop it on the floor, you own it. Brent. Right. With everything a success, I'm hoping Brent makes one important rule change with his hotel. Have you thought about what I mentioned about the children regarding children in the hotel, or are you still sticking with no children? You know what? I'm going to stick to the adults only. Adults only. Why? Well, look, at when you take two or three or four children up there, and I'm going to tell you, they wipe out the whole damn place. What, the noise? Noise, crying, whatever, uh, gum, and, uh, pop, and God forbid, uh, samples of ice cream. They will You talk. have a young daughter. I know. I'm talking three, four, eight-year-old. Have you asked yourself the consequences you know, of my missing on turnover, revenue? You know, we may miss a few, but I think we miss a few on the other end if they were two or three kids running down the hall. But not every, yeah. every kid is, is, is that noisy. I mean, just trying to be open with maybe a couple of rooms. I will give it thought. That's a tough one. I'm disappointed Brent won't alter his rules about allowing kids at the hotel. But hopefully, after seeing the success of the relaunch, he'll change his mind.